The king held an audience with the president of Nigeria at Buckingham Palace on Wednesday, just hours after a protester threw eggs at the monarch during his visit to York. It was business as usual for Charles back at Monarchy HQ as he welcomed Muhammadu Buhari to the official royal residence in London. During the audience in the 1844 room, Charles shook hands with the smiling president and was pictured chuckling and gesturing as he held his arms out wide. Earlier, as the king and queen consort arrived at York's medieval gateway Mikla Gate Bar, a protester began booing them before throwing four eggs in their direction, all of which missed. The protester was heard shouting this country was built on the blood of slaves. Charles continued shaking hands with dignitaries including the Lord Mayor as the eggs flew in his direction, pausing briefly to look at the shells cracked on the ground. North Yorkshire police confirmed that a 23-year old man was arrested on suspicion of a public order offence. He was later revealed to be Extinction Rebellion protester and former Green Party candidate Patrick Thelwill. The keen gardener studied politics and international relations at University of York, and plans to return to do a PhD in interdisciplinary global development there. On the same day it was announced that the Queen had died, he wrote on Twitter, I'm only sad that the Queen will not stand trial for her crimes against humanity. Finally, time to abolish the monarch and usher in a new era of anti fascist, ecological, direct democracy. I will not bow to the new false king, will you? The king went on to unveil a statue of his mother, the late Queen Elizabeth II, the first to be installed since her death. In October, Charles sent a message of condolence to Mr. Buhari expressing his heartfelt sympathy over the devastating floods in Nigeria which have killed more than 600 people this year.